Hi, this is my project Biodiversity Comic for National Geographic Educator Certifications. So my name is Jan Julius and I've been teaching for 17 years now and I've been working as a curriculum coordinator and visual art teachers for kids 4 to 6 in one of uh, private schools in Indonesia. And I'm thinking that this project is really helping me to achieve this, my, this missions as educator especially to help students to develop attitudes and also their their curiosity as well as their learning skills to prepare for the global issue and challenges related to the environment. And there is connections that I make with uh, the National Geographic Learning Framework and also to see this lessons from different perspective from the cultural historical perspective, economical and ecological perspective, and as well as to develop the attitudes of responsibility, the communication skill, as well as knowledge about wildlife and wild places related to biodiversity and endangered animal. So we do these lessons uh, all in virtual environment. I use so many platforms to engage students as well as using the National Geographic resources for this. By using the script, students is encouraged to develop their communication skills as well as their research skills. They go through the National Geographic resources and also some other resources that I use to extend their knowledge about wildlife and white wild species. And this relates directly to the National Geographic Learning Framework on the knowledge of wildlife and wild species, the attitudes of responsibility as well as the skill of communications. The attitudes of responsibility is encoded through the National Geographic resources as well by raising awareness and we create comic to share to others, to educate others uh, through visual media. From the research that they do for writing the comic script, students actually have more perspective about the issue on endangered animal not only from ecological perspective which is uh, connected directly to biodiversity but also on the cultural perspective uh, from her research he she also find that from economic perspective hunting is a big uh, market hunting species endangered species is a big market because of the people selling their skin and so on. From my perspective as a student, the impact of this lesson helps me to expand my knowledge on wildlife, endangered animals and biodiversity. I'm now getting more curious about the life of endangered animals by browsing through multiple resources. I've done quite a lot of research and I realized that this topic is actually very interesting. This makes me wonder about the impact of biodiversity issues to other aspects, for example how people culturally eat meat or wear clothes from animal skin, and how it is part of our history as people from certain cultures. Plus, I know now that it actually produces big income but it has to stop to maintain our ecosystem. As students, there are some actions we can do and one of them is by educating others, starting by our family and friends around us. Spreading awareness is by letting other people know and doing what they can to stop this problem. And here are some of the results of students' work. In the conclusion, I think that it helps students to understand the concept of biodiversity and seeing it from the perspective of endangered species. 
It also encourages positive attitudes toward environment and also foster learning skill that is necessary for dealing with current environmental issues and challenges, especially the learning skills to make to communicate ideas through visual form. And this course also opened the door for me to, and students to the uh, amount, the vast amount of national geographic resources that is reliable and relevant to many learning units that we are learning. And of course, we will use them and promote them to others. And my education belief have been strengthened with the values, content knowledge, and understanding skills that I gained from these lessons. So I hope this lesson is useful. Thank you for the opportunity and stay curious.